Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Leos. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Leos. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy-ass temple of yours, Leos, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages, source, your guardian angels and ancestors have for you today in regards to love, Aries. Ooh, Aries. Some of y'all are dating in Aries, Leo. What's going on? Okay, I know who I'm talking to now, Spirit. I'm talking to my lioness and my lions, okay? So some of y'all in Aries may be very significant there for you. All right, but let's get into it, okay? So first, we're going to start here with the Soul Lessons Journey deck here. We're going to see this is another episode of tapping into your higher self, seeing what your higher self wants to inform you in regards to your spiritual path and your spiritual journey here. All right, definitely, of course, stick around. We're going to continue business as usual with the Love Romance Angel deck here to see what's going on in your love life, Leos, and see who's coming towards you in regards to love. All right, of course, stick around. We're going to use the traditional tarot deck here. See what's going on in tarot land and see what's beneath the surface there for you. And of course, we're going to finish up with some word advice from your guardian angels and your ancestors, okay? Source angels, ancestors of the highest light. Please protect my space and aura and most of all, my heart. As I channel the messages here today for Leos, what do we have for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and South Node placements for Leos? What do we have here? What do their higher selves want to inform them during this time here? Guardian Angels, Ancestors of the Highest Light. Again, welcome back to the ones that are new here. All right. Shout out to the Evolving Spirits as well. I definitely want to give thanks to you all. I appreciate you. I thank you all so much. If you would love to become an Evolving Spirit as well, please click that join link down below. It gives you exclusive discounts on your personal readings, your email questions, and your love live stream questions when I go live as well. Okay. Shout out to our new color of the week here. Okay. Definitely if you're new here, the new color here this week, it may resonate for you as well. It's the color yellow yellow yes that's right leos the color of the week focuses in on our solo plex chakra here for the color yellow which talks about spiritually as far as creating starting over starting fresh okay taking that leap of faith okay and being creative all right so definitely i encourage you all this week if you want to join the community here on love and forever evolving and wear you some yellow okay eat some yellow fruit and vegetables for yourself as well okay and work on that solar plexus okay get connected in with your spirit and your higher selves okay go look up what the color yellow means spiritually for you all right and join us okay this is the way where we also evolve here on this channel as well all right so let's see what card came out here for you oh we have denial here all right we have i acknowledge my fear but i replace it with the insight of awareness okay so this is a situation where you at this time may be in denial of a situation here or what someone may have done to you all right leos or have said to you here and you kind of trying to pick it up i feel here as in that this really just happened is this person really doing this am i really hearing this for what it truly is here okay so know that whatever here however is happening all right it's happening for your highest good it's happening to give you clarity and give you truth here so just acknowledge it okay don't allow fear or any feelings or negative thoughts to get in your way here i feel leos okay and replace it all right and replace this feeling here that you're feeling here with some insight of awareness meaning that be grateful that whatever feeling that you're feeling here it's giving you insight in regard in regards to uh clarity right in regards to getting some truth here in regards to a situation here so some of you all this could also be the particular energy around you that may be in denial of a situation here denial of the truth here denial of their reality and what's in front of them here okay so just whichever way it could be flipped okay the roles can always be flipped Flipped here but there is definitely a situation here where energy here is needing to replace the insight or the awareness here what they're feeling here or what they're seeing and replace it with 
being gratitude and being glad like for an example i am so glad that this happened the way that it happened even though i wasn't expecting it right leos but because of this situation happened or played out the way that it happened i'm not gonna deny this i'm gonna take this person or their actions and what they've shown to me or if they shown their character to you if this person shown their personality to you now you're gonna take it for what it is because i feel like if you don't you know, this is a situation where it could get worse from here, right? Or this is a situation where you can really start to see this person's true colors or their characteristics or personalities play out here for you. So for some of y'all, because of how this person may have act or whatever this situation or circumstance here is regarding here, I feel like it was meant for you to see it unfold as it did so that way this can give you clarity and give you awareness of what's really going on here for some of y'all even behind scenes here right so instead of denying this instead of being in denial or denying this situation here take it for what it is take it for a grain of salt okay and take it for what it is and you move forward leos the best way you know how all right it's a reason for this happening there is no accidents and there's no coincidences here okay so whatever this situation however it occurred for you allow it to run its course here okay that's what i'm picking up intuitively here in regards to your lesson journey here and what's needed to be recognized here with your spirit and your higher self okay and at the bottom of the card here we have loneliness here okay i know that i am never alone yes that is so true all right some of y'all may feel like here that you may feel like you are alone okay or you don't feel like you have anyone that you can talk to or that you can communicate with here or that you can express the way how you feel know that you're not alone here leos and you see all these angels here that is around this particular circle here Okay, this is like reminding me that you have your guardian angels and you have your ancestors here. Believe it or not, Leos, you are not alone. Okay, and this is what your guardian angels and your ancestors want you to know. In regards to this situation, whatever went down, whatever situation or circumstance that has happened here, okay, that you feel like you don't have no which way to go or turn or who to look up to, know that you have your ancestors here and you're never alone. Okay, this is the perfect time for you to tune in with yourself and your guardian angels and allow yourself to get whatever guidance spiritually that you're needing here because your guardian angels is here with you okay you're not alone okay just because you may feel like that way physically here because you can't touch or see anyone here but in regards to spiritually wise you're not alone you have an ancestral team here that is willing to fight for you okay you just have to know that all right so keep doing what it is that you're doing here don't give up all right, and keep moving forward here, okay? Wow, beautiful. Thank you, God and angels and ancestors for those messages. Those are your messages in regards to your higher self, okay? What you're needing to focus on this week as far as spiritually wise, okay? This is another episode of your spiritual path and your spiritual journey and what needs to be brought to the forefront here, okay? So what needs to be brought to the surface here is not denying the situation here for what it is. Take it as clarity for you and what you needed to see or what you needed to know here leos okay so this can help you push through and know that you are not alone okay i shake all right i love you you know i do leos okay all right so let's move forward here we're going to use the kipper deck here to see what's going on here all right let's see what the kipper deck has to say here in regards to your spiritual path here guardian angels ancestors what else here do we have here for my sexy ass lions all right, definitely if that resonated for you, again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, my loves, okay? Definitely if you're new here, welcome to family. All right, subscribe, my loves. Join the Soul Tribe here, all right? Click that join link down below. Again, it gives you exclusive discounts. I am available for personal readings. If you would love to book a personal reading with me, my loves, that information is down below. Ooh, what else here is down below? We have a wealthy man here, honey. I'm just saying Leo's around. Okay, or this could be a healthy woman coming in here for you, lions, okay? But however here, there is someone that's very well successful and grounded here, okay, that I feel like definitely has their eye out on you, lions. And yay! All right, so definitely, my loves, whatever it is that you're doing, honey, believe me, you're definitely not alone. You have eyes around you, okay? Someone finds that you 
you are very sexy, very confident in yourself here. You may be putting yourself out here on social media here. You may have someone that is watching you here. It could be a masculine energy here for you lioness, okay? And lions, this could be a feminine energy here that is watching you. They're very observant and watching you paying close details playing close to details when it comes to you here okay so let's see here guardian angels what else here do lions need to know whoa whoa thank you yes honey look at here we have unexpected income coming in here i also feel like this is an opportunity here as well that's coming towards you all here you may get an increase in your income here through your employment okay or through your job or career here okay whatever this is i feel like you're going to get an increase when it comes to your finances here and this is going to be again here something unexpected here okay and this is what i feel like for some y'all is going to even upgrade you in regards to your status here okay so some of you all are becoming a wealthy man or a wealthy woman here, okay? So whatever it is you're doing, you're being recognized here. You're being seen in the public eyes here. And you're being granted here an opportunity here of an increase of an income. Someone might like what it is that you do. Someone may, you know, find you very interesting here and want to offer you an opportunity here as well. All right, wow, we have the false person here, okay? Some of you all, you have someone that's in your energy here that's not being honest here, okay? They may could be a certain way here in front of you and behind closed doors. They could be someone totally opposite, okay? So be aware of your surroundings here, all right, Leos? Make sure that you are very paying a close attention to your intuition and using your discernment here when it comes between you and meeting others, okay? That's very significant here for you okay so wow let's finish up here we're going to get out the tarot deck here see what's going on in tarot land all right and definitely stick around we're going to use the love romance angel deck here and see who's coming towards you in regards to love leos yes all right so let's see here guardian angels ancestors of the highest light what other messages here do we have for my leos guardian angels ancestors of the highest light what else do we have here for an angels, ancestors of the highest light for Leo placements? What else do we have here when it comes to love? What do we have for Leos? Sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, and south node. What do we have here for Leo placements, Gordon angels? Thank you. We have the Seven of Swords. Yes, someone is definitely doing something sneaky behind scenes here, love, okay? You notice how he has his fingers crossed here, okay? So like I said, someone could be presenting themselves as a certain way in front of you here. Leo's behind closed doors here. They are doing something very sneaky here, okay? This could be a feminine energy here, or this could even be a masculine energy here with the Seven of Swords here, okay? But this energy here talks about deception here, right? Doing something behind your back, betraying you behind your back, not being honest to you, okay? Lying to you, stealing from you with these swords behind this person's back here, okay? Speaking behind your back, saying mean things, awful things about you to other people behind their back here, okay? They're there's definitely someone around you that is wearing a false mask here, okay, that you need to pay highly close attention to here, okay? This could be an ex here. This could be someone that you've engaged your energies here with before. This could be someone that just simply doesn't agree to you or like the way that you present yourself here. This could even be a family member to some of y'all. This is someone, again, that you are engaging here with, and they are not being who they say that they are here, okay? Let's see what else here, Guardian Angels, Ancestors of the Highest Light. Let's get some more cards out here and see what else is going on here, Guardian Angels. What else do we have here for legal placements? Guardian Angels, Ancestors of the Highest Light. What else here do we have for Leo placements? What else, Guardian Angels? Thank you. 
All right, we have the chariot card here, count searing energy here. Yes, some of y'all, I feel like you have moved forward here or you're in the process of moving away from this particular person or this situation here. Okay, literally some of y'all may be moving to another city, another state here, another town here. You're thinking about moving here, okay? Moving somewhere where there's a better energy here, there's a better atmosphere, a better environment here for you and your family here. Because you're finding out that people that you may have been around or people that have been in your life here, they're not here for your highest good or they're not happy they're not happy to see you progress here okay this could be even a sister or a brother here okay some type of family member here is involved as well here i feel here okay like i said some of this person could be an air sign here or a water sign here okay but there is definitely someone in your energy here that i feel like because everything that you have going on here okay and what you're trying to pursue and manifest for yourself here someone is not happy about that okay someone may be seeing the wealth here that you're gaining here over time just spiritually here and growing and evolving they seem that you are different here and seeing you in another light here and now they're trying to come back towards you here and they're in this energy where one minute they may be returning to you saying hey leos i've changed i'm a better person now i'm doing this i'm doing that but behind closed doors, they have their fingers here crossed. They're not being honest here, okay? So be mindful of this particular energy or this person here, okay? One more card here, Guardian Angels, Ancestors for Leo, placements here. What else do they need to know? What else do we have for Leo placements? What else, Guardian Angels, Ancestors of the Highest Light? Whoa, we have two cards that jumped out here. Let's see what we have here for you, loves. We have the world card here, okay? This is definitely a cycle here that's closing out for you. The color orange may be very significant for you as well, all right? That talks about your sacral chakra here, working on ways to create and get up out of a situation, trying to see a situation again for what it truly is, which is kind of reflecting off of the denial card here, all right? accepting what is in front of you is the truth and is what a person is really who or who they really are excuse me okay so what i'm picking up here is that there is a particular person here leos i feel like for whoever this is resonating for okay this could be for a group of you okay but however here there is again someone in your energy here and your higher selves or your spirit guides here are wanting you to see the true colors of this person here and know that this person is not being genuine here, okay? This could be an ex or this could be someone that you've engaged your energies here with the past. This could be a lost friend here that you were once friends with or, you know, someone from your career, or your workplace here, someone that you used to engage with on a daily basis here and spend a lot of time and energy towards here. But this cycle now has ended here, okay? Or it's time to end this cycle here because this is someone that's not for your highest good. I feel like you guys are also sensing this energy here or picking this energy up yourselves here, okay? But this is confirmation to let me know that you all have passed this test here. You have passed this cycle here, okay? You have evolved from this particular person here, okay? You're no longer in this frequency and vibration here of where you left this person at. And this is the hard problem I feel like this person is also having a problem with being in denial about is that you're not the same person here, Leos. You're growing. You are evolving. Congratulations. Okay, honey, fuck it up, Leos. Okay. And I feel like this person here is watching you. Okay. You could have a social media website or you could do something in the community eyes like I myself. Okay. You may have your own community, but whatever it is that you're doing, this particular person is definitely paying close attention to this. And they know just as much as you know that this cycle has completed here with the world card, okay? So you have your free will, okay? You can continue to move forward here, okay? And do what it is that you need to do here. Speak your truth, okay? Yes, we have the queen of fucking wands. Fuck it up. Look again at all this orange again, okay? Orange is very, very significant here. This may be someone's favorite color here. Or this is a color that you need to focus in on yourself, okay? It's time for you to start being creative. It's time for you to take back control of your life, Leos, okay? is what I'm picking up here as well, okay? People see you as very confident, very sexy, very attractive here, okay? So whatever this is that you're doing here, honey, keep it up, okay? Because like I said, someone is definitely watching, honey. Just when you think someone is not watching... 
Oh, they watch it. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and pull out the love romance angel deck here, Leos. Don't be laughing at me, okay? Let's see what's going on in your love life here, okay? And yes, the Pandora song you got in here before I almost forget here, okay? Halfway through your reading here, right? My apologies. My apologies, Leos. You know I love you. Okay, but the song you got here, I believe, let me double check here. It was by... um. Yes, it was by Usher called My Boo, okay? So this particular person here, you see this person as your boo or this person sees you as their boo, okay? It's, well, how did that song go? It started when we were younger, you were mine, my boo. All right, so this person, someone you could have met here when you were growing up or in your childhood energy, and I feel like you two may be meeting back up with each other or you're getting to know this person here. This is someone that's maybe younger than you or you may be younger than this person here, okay? But this is someone here that sees you as their boo, okay? They find you very attractive here again. They see that you're very sweet and kind, and I feel like this is what they love about you as well, her Leos, okay? But this person already sees you as their boo, right? They're called calling you their boo okay or you might be calling this person your boo or you're just getting those boo vibes honey okay and this is what this person likes about you all right so let's see what's going on in your love life here leos what an angel's ancestor of the highest light what do we have for leo placements here what do leos need to know here garden angels thank you wow yes i cannot make this up Yes, we have very soon here. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now, Leos, okay? So in regards to you and this particular person here, honey, you're going to have to be making a decision here very soon, okay? That cycle here in the past here, you want to go ahead and close that out as quickly as possible here, okay? Definitely if this is in regards to an ex here that you're needing to close the cycle out with here because you're about to have a connection here with someone here pretty soon, okay? So definitely do what it is you need to do. Do all the healing work because you want to be ready for this person it's not fair to allow this person to come in if you definitely haven't healed all the way from this particular energy here this person who may have betrayed you in the past here make sure that you're continually doing the healing here and if you are single here know that this is what you have coming towards you here okay you definitely have someone that has their eyes on you here okay so definitely continue to do what it is that you're doing here okay this is a beautiful next or connection here that's coming in towards you here okay guardian angel ancestors of the highest light what else here guardian angels do we have what else do we have here for leo placements sun moon rising venus and north and south node yeah and i feel like for others you all this could be this particular energy or this person from the past that you have removed your energies from that could be feeling lonely here as well or in denial because you have decided to move forward here and you are doing what makes you happy okay what else regarding angels what else is going on with leos wow yes we have love yourself first leos okay your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive yes beautiful okay so what it is that you do i'm seeing two 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 on the clock so you're definitely coming into balance here with your higher self all right with your masculine and your feminine energy here with your lower and your higher self everything is balancing out for you this is the year that represents the number six where we are starting to balance out within our family within our home within reunions and connections and partnerships coming together because last year represented the number five which brought about conflicts okay in order to get you out of situations where you were not growing or where you wasn't happy and this year everything is starting to balance itself out and moving forward okay so this is the energy that i feel like you all are in here okay and the more that you're loving yourself the more that this person is watching you from whatever platform or website here that you got going on honey or social media they love how confident you are in yourself you're showing up in your own energy here honey this is the queen of wands aka the king of wands okay this is your energy leo energy here okay they see how sexy and again confident you are and they love this about you because they don't see this i feel here on a daily basis so as the much that you are encouraging yourself 
from going through your own trials and tribulations as much as you are, you know, keeping yourself motivated. You're also motivating others, whether you notice or not. Okay, so even if you felt like you were lonely, honey, you're not because you have people that feel and see things the way you feel and see things as well here. Okay, so keep doing whatever it is that you're doing and allow this cycle to close out because you definitely have beautiful energies that are coming towards you. They're going to be more like minded people. These people are going to be your soul tribe here. Okay, honey, what else? One more card here for my sexy ass lions in regards to their love life. What else is coming towards Leo's here? Yes, we have stay optimistic about your love life. Yes, do not give up, okay? Positive thinking and faith will bring you together. It's like the moment that you do is when somebody, boom, comes in here for you, okay? So, because baby, trust me, they coming, honey, okay? I don't give a fuck if this is tomorrow, next week, next month, next year. Just know you got to keep doing what it is you're doing because everything works in divine timing here, okay? So, the more you work on yourself, the more you heal, this is what you're looking forward to here. This is what you're calling in for yourself. Last card here we have is separation. Time apart from your partners on the horizons. Yes, some of y'all are going through a separation right now as we speak here, okay? Some of you all are recognizing that this particular person, they're no longer resonating with your spirit and your higher self. This person is not wanting to evolve. This person doesn't want to adjust and grow and become better in one union together. And I feel like you all are recognizing this for this small group of you and you're ready to move forward. Okay, some of y'all may be literally fouling on the voice here or removing yourself from this particular person's energy here because you know what your spirit and your higher self is calling for you to do here. Okay, so some of you y'all you're in this energy and you're getting ready to separate from this person others you are like i said you have already separated yourself from this person you've already seen this person characteristics here and the things that they have done behind your back the portrayal all of this okay and no more of that you're moving forward now okay and this is what you're going to be receiving here in the future is someone that's going to give you true genuine love not someone that's going to do things behind your back and not be honest to you okay but you have to close out this cycle here okay all right. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. You know, I already know I do. Okay. All right. So let's finish up here. I want to see how this particular person here that's all up on you or going to be all up on you. Okay. I want to see how this particular person feels towards you here, Leos. Okay. If you don't mind, if I be the fly on the wild for just a little bit. Okay. Just a tiny bit, Leos. Okay. All right. And then we'll finish up here with some word advice here from your guardian angels and your ancestors. Okay. And again, definitely again, if the reading has resonated, my love don't hesitate to hit that big fat thumbs up show spirit some love again if you're new here welcome welcome i love subscribe and be a part of family this is definitely what we do here every day we love and we find ways to evolve my loves okay so definitely check out the community board all right hang around with me my love i always post daily enlightenment there and always give you guys heads up on what's going on with the platform here definitely join me live okay we have a good time we pull a couple of tarot decks and you're welcome to ask love questions okay Okay? and go ahead and join the community with us and wear the color yellow this week work on your solar plexus here eat you some yellow fruits and some yellow vegetables okay enhance and set those intentions and get on that new fresh start okay because you guys are definitely going into a new cycle here with the world card here showing up some y'all could be seeing tnt okay talks about ending cycles and going into new cycles here okay so that yellow energy definitely represents that leo energy that lion energy as well okay so definitely join us all right what else do we have for guardian angels how does this particular person feel towards my lions i'm looking for you wow i told you i told you that there is someone out here okay right this is a masculine energy or a feminine energy here okay listen up listen leos okay someone is definitely looking you they have their eye on they have their eye fucking i'm hearing damn i heard they have their eye glued to you okay damn gina i don't know what you're doing to them leos but they have their eyes glued on you okay so they're literally lurking watching you i wouldn't be surprised this person be driving by your damn house i'm just saying i don't know who the fuck this is but that's what i heard in my head leos i ain't making this shit up yes we have i was very shy okay so this person may be very shy okay they may not communicate a lot so they rather just glue them eyes on you okay so this is definitely someone i feel like you may have a secret 
Secret Admirer, okay? Or they're definitely keeping to themselves on how they feel towards you, okay? We have I Wish We Could Be Together Right Now. Oh, see, like I said, you may have not met this this person particularly yet here. You know, everything starts spiritually here, Leos, before it's manifest here in the physical realm, okay? So I feel like some of y'all may be doing a lot of telepath, uh, telepathically, excuse me, communication right now with this person your spiritual dreams you could be having dreams about being in this certain type of relationship here and as you know this is what you're manifesting here because the more you visualize this the more you feel this way this is what you end up manifesting okay so this is definitely someone that is wishing and feeling the same way that you are and you're eventually going to end up crossing paths with this person here leos okay whether you know that or not because this is definitely happening in the spiritual realm okay yes we have let me pull up i'm ready i can't i'm telling you somebody is coming towards you leos okay i can't put my finger on it but there is definitely someone coming okay all right yes we have all i think about is you this is what i keep picking up here okay it's gonna be different for all of you here some of y'all you've already met this person here okay some of y'all you haven't had the slightest clue yet of who this person is or what they're gonna look like but all you know is that you damn near can feel it okay all right so definitely do not give up when it comes to your love life here okay definitely okay because the minute you do all right so again remain positive 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 thoughts okay so let's finish up here let's get you some word of advice here before we close out your spread again powerful reading here again a lovely beautiful reading here definitely my loves i am now back available for personal readings all right if you would love to book a personal reading with me all that information is down below as well in the description box my loves okay so let's get you some word of advice from your guardian angels and your ancestors here source angels ancestors of the high it's like, what word advice here can we provide Leo placements here today? What do they need to know? What do we have here for Leo placements here, Guardian Angels? What do we have for Leo placements? Thank you. All right, my loves. Let's see what we have here for you. All right, we have the number 12 breaks down to the number three here. Okay, that's feminine energy here. Okay, some of y'all might be seeing the number three. Wow, and I just seen the number three on the clock. Okay, so the number three is very significant. Okay, definitely go look up the number three and see what the spiritual messages is there for you. All right, we have awakening here, okay? This talks about going through that spiritual awakening here, okay? Coming to realization here in regards to not denying what's in front of you and what your reality is here, Leos, and also not understanding and now overstanding that you are not alone. You have your spirit, guys. You have your ancestor team that's fighting with you okay it says look at things from a different perspective yes okay so some y'all now have a different perspective as well here you're viewing things from your third eye beautiful lions okay it says a temporary standstill yes because i feel like some y'all may have felt stuck here in your past or what it is that you wanted to do how you want to accomplish your life moving forward because like i said you guys are starting that new path that new journey you're starting over you're starting fresh you're taking that leap of faith you're in that full energy right now okay that's that color yellow that's that starting over that starting fresh energy okay so definitely amplify that with wearing the color yellow and the color orange over here okay it says it's important to be yourself yes leos okay that's the most beautiful thing to me is when you can be your authentic self you can imagine about how much beauty you can bring out of yourself and even others when you're being your true authentic self okay so don't steer away from that keep doing what it is you're doing and be yourself be yourself be simple and be fucking happy okay wow leo's beautiful reading here again definitely if the reading has resonated with your spirit and your higher self again don't forget to like subscribe hit the notification bell again if you have enjoyed the energies my loves click that join link down below again it gives you exclusive discounts on your personal readings your email questions and again your love live stream questions when i go live my loves okay we definitely have our own private community chat room as well 
you can chat with me one on one i do also provide daily content over there as well all right so definitely click that join link and join the soul tribe my loves i love you all so much leos you take care okay and don't give up on yourself keep pushing okay we need you leos i love you Mwah! Bye-bye.